This is the regular Mushroom Gorge Gap Jump. And this is the faster but more challenging Fence Gap. But the big question is, how much time does the Fence Gap save? Let's find out. It's not that much faster. I think generally speaking, it's a no-brainer that on laps one and two, the regular and safe gap jump is the way to go. However, in a lap three situation, if it's bound to be a close finish like most Mushroom Gorge races are, it actually may be in your best interest to go for the fence gap. Just be aware that failing it will cost you a ton of time, especially at the very end of the race. In all honesty, after seeing this comparison, I really don't think the fence gap is worth it at all. So unless you're feeling ballsy or the pack is really, really close and it matters, I would not go for this online. If you want to get better at Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, make sure to subscribe and keep on giving her, bud.